we don't have treatment at this point for osteoarthritis, hopefully in the future. So when you have pain, when you have osteoarthritis, you get anthroarticular injection of corticosteroids. This is a treatment that goes for thousands of patients every day, and I will say even hundreds of thousands every day. So it's really very common. We uh, looked at the data we have. Uh, in 2018, we have uh, around 500 injections, and we, we found 8% complications uh, in the hip and, and knees. Most of them are in the hip, 10%, and 4% in the knee. We found four complications in our study. The first one is rapid progressive osteoarthritis type 1, when you have a rapid cartilage loss more than two millimeters in less than one year. The second one, rapid progressive osteoarthritis type two, when you have a bone loss. The third one, it's a complication of osteonecrosis and collapse of the joint. And the fourth one is subchondral insufficiency fracture, which is a small fracture usually under the cartilage plate associated with a lot of inflammation. It's important for us as a physician and also as a patient to know that there are some complications that can be secondary to the injection. The patient should know it's not 100% a safe injection. Maybe there will be complications. If they consent on those complications, it's absolutely fine. For the doctor's physician like us, we need to know that these complications exist, they are real, we don't have 100% understanding uh, in which patient they will happen. They need to inform the patients about them. If the patient is not going for joint replacement, maybe they need to think about it twice before injecting those patients.